And now, um, what type of woman do you look for? If they're not interested in the guy, they'll pop the balloon. Next single guy, come on out. Have you hold this? Three or eight, four, five. Okay. And if wow. we can have you, hey, what do you do? Wow. So I just graduated law school, oh. so I just got hired for <laughs> door legal services. Uh -huh. Congratulations. This is this is why you you understand that women have no idea what they want. I say this all the time. Women don't know what they want. Their pussy does. I just <laughs> felt the young vibes um, immediately, and then I'm not sure if I like the hat. Didn't bother to get any to know anything about him, but just the just based on the hat, hat and shoes. You tossed out. I understand how a lawyer. I mean, I'm not an alpha male. I'm not a beta male either. I'm just a better man. Better man. This is a YouTube video where uh, women hold a balloon. A guy walks out. If they're not interested in the guy, they'll pop the balloon. Uh, I don't know, you know, what your, you know, whatever your 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 type is or your, your type preference. Is, yeah. But let's let's be honest. It's not a bunch of dimes on there. And look at these. Okay, our next single guy. Oh, Come on out. Right on over here. Have you hold this? Three or eight, four, five. Okay. And wow. if we can have your name. My name is Jeremy. And how old are you, Jeremy? I'm 27. 27. Okay. What do you do? Wow. So I just graduated law school. So oh. I just got hired for door legal services. Uh -huh. Congratulations. You just immediately fucking got rid of a guy who graduated law school. <laughs> This is this is why you you understand that women have no idea what they want. This is this is I say this all the time. Women don't know what they want. Their pussy does. Have no idea. No idea what. what didn't even. But here's the thing. Didn't. It's fine that they have no idea. Didn't bother to wait to have any idea. And by the way, it's not a game show. There's no clock on this. No, 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 no. There's no. They didn't have to. If you watch, if you back it up, one chick is trying to pop the balloon. She couldn't pop it and she's stabbing at the. If you back up like Hold on. Hold on. That's wild. <laughs> she's just uh, Jason in her balloon. Right on over here. Here we go. Have you hold this? Okay. And if we can have that your bitch. name. That was, she was too dumb to figure out how to pop a balloon. How to pop a She's popping it at the stand. <laughs> my ex, and it's, of course, she's the one wearing the shirt that says, "My ex is my biggest fan." Now let me let me say something. She's a very voluptuous woman, but let uh, she's probably young. I'd love to know how old she is. And let's say she's twenty something years old. Mm -hmm. You pretty much could count five pounds. Five, you you could count five pounds a year, eh, three pounds a year. That she will be gaining, you're saying three to ten, three to five pounds a year, every year. So she is at the she has the is at the 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 etch the echelon. She's at the Golden Gates. She's at the of, maximum of capacity fat bitch, of fat bitch right now. She is on. She is right there in the right in there before she's a fat bitch. And got it's like how they say you could be pre. Your doctor goes, you're pre diabetic. Yeah, she's pre fat bitch. But go ahead. Yeah. Well, the doctor goes, you got to do something about this immediately. <laughs> like, <laughs> turns out to be a law student, which is yeah. a graduate. Graduate, not even a law student, yeah, yeah, graduate. Yeah. First of all, look at the, the, the one with the one the, on the right, the one all yeah. the way on the right. The one where her, her toes is hanging over the shoes. Oh, like, what? <laughs> she, she, Let me see if I could move our faces from there. Yeah, <laughs> oh, she. Her toes of, hanging over the front of the shoes so it is what it the is. one who looks like wilma and fred flintstone yeah, yeah that one. Oh boy yeah she should not be popping the balloon for anybody the nerve the nerve of her but all right whatever he's one night whatever so got secrets and shit talk okay. to me you know what i'm saying let me know okay you know what i'm saying all right so we did get a couple of pop balloons let's go over to these ladies and see oh. what's going on all right yeah, yeah. okay let's start here if we can have your the name and how old one. you are wait hold on what did he say I, I, I think the pop was just the, so. This is another lesson to be learned that uh, you, um, you, you, you know, women, women look to each other, women, uh, other women to to decide whether you're whether you're attractive. So a man who has women uh, is is attractive or desirable because other women find him attractive and they, and they try to impress each other too, impress each other, outdo each other. They're they're affected by. Yeah. The decisions, the trends that other people make. Like, you know, if you got a friend, right? And uh your friend like just sucks at getting women or he just is, you know, and they're like they look down on the woman you're with, you're like, I don't give a shit. This guy yeah. what the fuck does this guy know about? Hey, about uh, shit? I mean we like uh Kenny Kenny, you know, Kenny Kenny love a 
Well, Kenny Joseph, comedian Kenny Joseph Kenny, is a good previous of guest the of the show, show, a good friend, one of my so best friends. Check yeah. him out on, on the older stuff. Uh, Kenny, uh, Kenny loves Kenny loves the heavyweight division. Let's just let's just say I mean, that. We, we're starting at two thirty. He'll he'll start at two thirty. Well, yeah, he he's he's had girls that have uh, you know when a baby has creases in their knees and their thighs, oh, he, boy. He, and it's cute. Yeah, he, he yeah. was cute when she's three two thirty. Well, none of these women, none of Kenny's uh, girls have to make weight, you know, for a fight. Let's just put it that way. They don't have to do any weight cuts. <laughs> it's to, all to remain in but the heavy. Fight. You know, but um, I remember. But it's nice because back in the day, Kenny and I were never competing never, over the same girl. Competed, it was nice. You know, like, but she is at the she is at the weight limit right there. Yeah, I mean, yeah, this is this, ass, but one baby, one baby. One baby, we're talking. We we're talking one Thanksgiving dinner. It's done. Yeah, yeah. she's not going to look like that next January. It, it's yeah. done. She's not going to make it through the holiday season. There, there, there's only so many spanks you could do to, you know, cover that up. And then, you know, and then you got a half a girlfriend next to her. So, but go ahead. She's a five. And Fiano, why did you end up popping your balloon? I just <laughs> felt the young vibes um, immediately, and then I'm not sure if I like the hat and the shoes. Uh, okay. <laughs> The hat and the shoes. Okay, all right. Didn't bother to get any to know anything about him, but just the just based on the shoes. hat and shoes, you tossed out. I understand a, how a lawyer. I mean, have to understand how frivolous this is. What counts you in and counts you out. The point is, this is what you're dealing with as a guy on a on a daily basis. Just because women have the 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 market is skewed towards women. Because guys will do anything that a woman wants or listen to her or not, you know, at, will not call out any negativity because they're yeah. trying to get laid. Yeah. And as a result, women have the market. It's a buyer's market for women. And when you have that many choices, you start to get, you know, make arbitrary decisions. You can just oh, cause you can. be picky because yeah. you can. Cause and, you're, and here's the other thing. Your understanding is that this guy wants me, but he don't want to. He wants to fuck you. He hasn't decided whether he wants to. Men have have control over relationships. Women have control over sex. So just because a guy wants to fuck you doesn't mean that doesn't mean that he wants to marry you or he wants to be in a relationship. And um, you know we have uh, you know plenty of guy has slept with somebody who he's ashamed of. Uh, you know, so that that's not that's not, not Kenny Josephs. Not, not Kenny, Kenny Josephs. He he puts him in the front row. Fiona, what you looking for in a guy? I'm looking for a maturity. I'm looking for a leader. Okay. Um, and a breadwinner. What? Okay. So maturity. Uh, you money. could argue. That's money, money, that, money. <laughs> yeah, money, money, money. This guy graduated from from law school, but because he got a hat on <laughs> for this dumb internet show. Yeah. You know this this stupid. Crazy. She's 34. She should be taking all. If she's serious about. Finding a man and getting married. This is her last year of eligibility. Yeah, she needs to be take. She is. She is. Uh, she's gonna have to walk. She's gonna have to try out again next year. Yeah, she's gonna have to do a walk on or red shirt or something. She ain't got no contract. Bro. She's like one of those eighteen. Those those guys that keep failing high school and then at the they turn eighteen and the high school has to be like you can't come in anymore. Like, this is interesting and not, not you know maybe this is my age speaking, but you're thirty four years old and you got a nose ring. Like come on, like. <laughs> What are you doing? Trying anyway, to be young. Trying to yeah. that's the irony is you're 34 trying to be young. Here's a here's a 26 year old trying to be mature, and you look at him like he's a pile of shit. Um, I popped the balloon for the fit because I know we both got on the phone and he said dress to impress, uh -huh. and you wearing a hoodie. But honestly, I'm feeling the inside. Like I like the voice. I like that you are interested in getting to know us. Yeah. I love your you know. I like all this stuff on the inside once I got to, it's almost as if I should have taken the time to get to know you a little bit. I popped the balloon in the first boat. Instead of popping. The fact that she likes you, I like you too. I'm not yeah. getting left out. Yeah. I love your, you know, I, I, like your swag, whatever you want to call mm -hmm. it. Like, I like that. Part of his fit is the swag, <laughs> dummy. <laughs> and then she why'd you end up popping your balloon? Um, again, the fit, um, um, I like the shoes. I just think that you maybe could have cleaned them up before you came yeah. and maybe styled it a little bit different, but I do really like the shoes. Um, and I do it. like that you representing your LLC, your brand, your shit. Um, yeah. Your that's shit. That's dope. 
Um, and I really love that you always. She ran. She ran out of adjectives so quick. She goes, "Yeah, your 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 brand, your LLC, uh, your shit." Yeah. Low key, like when you kind of walked on, it was kind of giving like I don't want to say goofy because like that's that's a terrible word, but it was just like. But you said you it out loud. Out. I don't want to say I don't want to say something insulting. I want to say stupid and yeah. like a moron, but I mean that's what I mean. Goofy. Let me ask you something. You toxic. No, honestly, um, I'm a behavioral health therapist. So when I started that job, I kind of like started to work on myself. And that was the beginning of my like um, self journey. So like I've worked on myself a lot. I used to be toxic. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. I used to be that girl. Yeah. But I ain't no more. You I'm miss your ex. Me. Say it again. You miss your ex. No. Uh, okay, my ex is my biggest fan. Oh yeah, but he is. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he been. Oh, is it off the body? <laughs> is it off the body? That's what he doing. Yeah. Uh huh. Are you chewing gum, bitch? Yeah, of course she is. Are, are you chewing gum and you can't spit out your, your gum? You're judging this fucking guy? And she has the nerve to go, I don't like your shoes. If you love what we're doing here, go to Patreon.com. It's the best way to support us and check out all the bonus content. That's right. Patreon.com slash Manschool202. We do weekly bonus episodes. We do listener mail, dating tips. And also, if you love the show, you can go back to the archive starting from episode one. All the episodes will be there at Patreon.com slash Manschool202. Um, yeah, so I just popped my balloon. I think everything you're saying sounds great. I like that you give off like a positive energy. Yeah. Um, which is really good. Um, it just seems like you're a little bit young. Okay. You remind me of maybe like a, a younger sibling that I have. Okay. Um, but I think your head is on straight. I think you got some big things that you got going on, and I respect that. Yeah. By the way, he's four years younger than her, right? She's 31. He's supposed to be 27 or 26. He's four or five years younger. But here's the interesting thing about this, Dante, is that she is saying she didn't say she regrets popping the balloon she just said i popped the balloon almost to say i popped it too quick yeah and i like what you're saying you're super positive i like the vibe you're putting out it's just that you seem a little bit young so even in she can't even take accountability that she yeah. fucked up the fact she that it went to, and and i mean the fact that she you know i i, I just want to hear what she does let's okay. see why are you single at 31 um, Damn, good question, kid. Another lawyer question. I like it, kid. I think I'm really picky, and um, I like what I like, and sometimes men tell me that my expectations are a little too high. So so that was a man that was obviously older than 31 or 31, right? 30, yeah, that were older than... So older than you, right? All the men... So all the men that you've... That, basically, that, <laughs> all the cr criteria that you set all the criteria that you set up have not been working, but you're going to continue doing that same criteria. Of course. You know, you're going to be alone, sweetie. But go ahead. But it's men, though. See how she framed it? It's men because I'm too... Some of them say I'm too picky. Not I'm too picky. Men mm -hmm. say I'm too picky. Damn. The men. And older than me, but also younger guys. I feel like I'm kind of on a different journey. So I know what I was doing at, you know, in my 20s. Were you in law school? Fun, you know, do what I'm supposed to do. So I don't expect he was in law to step up, yeah. in you know, 20. 25 and or, you know, in their 20s and kind of be on the same type of stuff I'm on. So, so what you expect now yeah. of a man when you're 31? Um, I expect them to be a provider, a protector. Um, Money. Money. Have their communication together because I've noticed a lot of not even Give just me. men, but people in general, they don't know how to communicate. Communicating about money. Where is the money? <laughs> when are you going to get the money? Can I have the I'll money now? Have. <laughs> My name is Jessica. Know what I'm saying? And I'm 31. Know what I'm saying? Ooh. A 31. 31. That's been a rough three decades, honey. Yeah, she working in a coal mine. <laughs> <laughs> what, you've been testing dynamite for the last? What, what have you been doing for 30 years that you're only 31 years old? What's going on, honey? Working What's on the railroad. <laughs> With you've been you've been knocking down spikes with your face. Yeah. What's, Watching a video, you know, typical nonsense about just how people are. You know, women are respond to men in a different way with with no no respect, no level of uh, empathy at all. It's just well, it's a microcosm of the problems that are going on in relationships. The things men have to kind of navigate that people don't really talk about or address publicly. And I don't even think people who watch this video fully understand the ramifications of what they're seeing. I'm not an alpha male. I'm not a beta male either. 
I'm just a better man. Better man. Well, put your happiness first, because if you don't, they won't.